Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for February 25th of 2023. Well, it is titled Crescent Moon Occultation. So what do we see here? Well, here is an image from a couple of days ago on February the 22nd, where we see a thin crescent moon in the sky. And that is very close to two of the planets that we see here. In fact, very, very close to one of the planets. And that is what we call an occultation if one object passes in front of, an, of another. So from some locations, Jupiter, which is very close to the thin crescent moon there, was blocked out by the surface of the moon. Now the moon or any other object can pass in front of another one. So something closer like the moon passes in front of another object and blocks out its light and we call that an occultation. Sometimes a planet will pass in front of a star, although that takes an even more perfect alignment because of the much smaller angular sizes of them on the sky. But it is something that astronomers have used for times to study things like occultations, because they can give us a glimpse into something about an object that we couldn't ordinarily study from Earth. So how it disappears and how long it takes to disappear can tell us about the size of the object and may even be able to tell us something about its atmosphere as it is blocked out. So here we see uh, the planet Jupiter just up above and slightly to the right of the crescent moon. And we see down below a little bit to the left of center, we see the planet Venus. Now they are both very prominent in the evening sky right now. So if you get a chance to look right after sunset, you will see Venus there closer to the horizon and the J Jupiter up above it. Now, you will not see the moon because the moon would only there at a certain time. So the moon orbiting a lot faster will not remain in the same position and will change very quickly from day to day and will move move much more rapidly across the sky and continuously change its phase. So a month from now it will be back here again. But even as we watch these, these two planets are moving and are getting closer and closer together. So we can look over the next week or so that they're going to be getting closer together and undergoing what we would call a conjunction. Now a conjunction is when two objects are close together in the sky. So an occultation is when one object actually blocks out another. A conjunction just means that the two objects are relatively close together in the sky. And we will see Venus and Jupiter even closer over this next week. So that was our picture of the day for February 25th of 2023. It was titled Crescent Moon Occultation. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Saturn's Iapetus. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.